Welcome! In this video, we'll guide you through setting up catalogs, categories, and products in Commerce Cloud, Salesforce's e-commerce platform. Effective organization is essential in B2B e-commerce. Products need to be easily accessible, accurately described, and correctly priced. When you add products to your online store, make them easy to find and evaluate. Let's explore the steps to make that happen. First, plan your setup. Before you set up your storefront, take time to plan your setup. Consider your strategies for buyer groups, entitlements, and price books. Decide if you want to showcase every item individually or how you want to group them. Draft your category structure and keep it simple. Once your plan is ready, create a catalog. A catalog makes your products available to buyers and shoppers. Stores are assigned a default catalog, which you can use or replace with a different one. Each store can have only one catalog at a time. Let's create a catalog. First, log in to your Commerce Cloud account. In the Commerce app, select Catalogs. Click New and name your catalog. We'll use an office supply company for our examples today. Assign it to a store through the Catalogs Stores tab. Next, we'll create a category structure. Categories make products easier to discover in searches and through navigation. Please refer to the article linked in the description. Create categories. In catalogs, select your catalog and click Create Category. This is where we'll create categories, assign parent categories, and set sort order. Enter a name and description, like office furniture or cleaning supplies, Select a parent category for any subcategories. Select Show in Menu if you want the category to appear in a menu. And assign a sort order. The sort order determines the order in which a category or subcategory appears on the navigation menu and in filters. In our office supply example, we want office furniture listed first, desks second, and standing desks third. Click Save and New to create all your categories. With your basic structure in place, it's time to add products. You can bulk load products via CSV or add them one by one. To add a product, go to the Commerce app navigation menu. Select Product Workspace and click Add. Fill in the name, category, pricing, images, and any other custom attributes, then click Save. Make products available in your store by assigning them to categories. Here's how to categorize multiple products at once. In the Product Workspace, select Products and choose Add to Category from the Action menu. Select one or more categories, then Save. Extend your product range with variations and attributes. From Commerce Setup, choose Variation Guided Setup. Then follow the steps to add product variations and attributes. Now let's set up price books. All products must have an entry in the standard price book before they can be added to custom price books for specific stores or buyer groups. In the Pricing Workspace, Create a new price book and assign it to buyer groups or stores. Now that your price book is set up, you can assign prices to products. Go to the Product Workspace and select Pricing Workspace for a product. In the Pricing Workspace, select the right price book. Then click the Related tab to add products and assign prices. That's it! Following those steps allows you to see products neatly categorized in your store's online catalog. For more detailed instructions on all this and more, visit help.salesforce.com or explore trailhead.salesforce.com. Thanks for watching.